The Orange Democratic Movement Party has lost its political grip in northern Kenya, where the ruling United Democratic Alliance UDA has capitalized on the shift, emerging as the most popular political outfit in the region, a new report published by TIFA shows. According to the report, the number of people supporting UDA in the region rose to 45% in July 2023, up from 31% at the same juncture the previous year. In 2022, ODM and Jubilee were the preferred political parties in the area, with a combined popularity rate of 51% compared to UDA's 31%. And I quote from that particular report, just in late July last year, TIFA found that ODM and Jubilee combined were far more popular than was UDA, which was 51% versus 31%. Yet now UDA is twice as popular as ODM there, with the Jubilee support minimal end of quote. In contrast, UDA has retained popularity in its strongholds. As of July 2023, UDA was still the most popular party in the Central Rift and Mount Kenya regions, with approval rates of 48% and 45% respectively. Similarly, ODM's biggest stronghold remains Nyanza, where it, is, it was leading with an approval rate of 40%. The Raila-led party was also leading in cost with an approval rate of 23% with UDA close behind at 21% during the period under review. The, that being said, Tifa noted that since last year, both parties have seen shifts in terms of support, and I quote from their statement, over the last two years, there have been several major shifts in the distribution of political party support, the most notable being the rise of UDA and the erratic rise and fall of those either undecided or declined to identify with any party, end of quote. And the quote from their report, however, most recently since March, it is the decline of support for both UDA and ODM from 45% to 34% for the former and from 29% to 18% uh, for the latter. And the dramatic increase in the proportion of those and aligned from 14% to 40%. End of quote. Kenya Kwanza as a whole, despite being the preferred coalition, has lost 14% of its supporters just as a has lost 12%. Meanwhile, Jubilee's influence in the country has significantly waned. Currently, the number of Kenyans who are undecided about their political affiliations is steadily rising, having tripled in just under one year. The number of undecided Kenyans stands at 36%, up from 13% last year.